Well, hello there. I'm Gino Galento. Wendy's this on the camera, holding it. We got a beautiful view. How are you doing? How are you doing, Wendy? Oh, I'm doing great, honey. Well, say it. Come on, it's your video. Okay, let's jump. That's true. Okay. Um, all right, it's Gino. I'm driving. Um, I had an early call to work today at uh, Dogfight, a movie with Will Ferrell and Zach Galifianakis. I generally do not post this kind of videos, but it's time. Times have changed. I guess I gotta change with them and adapt to it, to the times. So uh, anyway, they um. Long story short, uh, one of the reasons why I'm posting this video is because to prove the point that no one, and I mean nobody run me away from wrestling or independent wrestling. Nobody ever told me to quit except me. I decided. I made a decision. Uh, back in 2001, I said uh, uh, to myself, I decided to have this plan that if in 10 years I didn't get what I wanted out of it, that I would retire. Well, here I am now, 2011. It's been 10 years. I didn't get what I wanted out of wrestling it became more of into an acting thing. So, uh, I'm going to go where the money is at, which is acting. I haven't stopped loving wrestling. Who knows, maybe later on I get involved in it somehow. I've said it for years. To be a wrestler is only a tip of the iceberg. There's so many ways that you can get involved in wrestling, not just, not just the wrestler or the referee. you got a lot of people involved behind the scenes. You have people that who happen to be the commission salespeople or whatever, you know. So, and then you have the people who write the stories, the you know, story writers and such. So, you got a team behind the production team. You have camera people. You had stunt coordinators at this point in the big leagues. Yes, stunt coordinators. Oh wow. Yeah, believe it or not, they do. Uh, a lot of the, I, I say, uh, what I've been told by the guys who work in the WWE, and trust me, I know quite a few. They all tell me that a lot of their matches are already predetermined from the beginning all the way to the finish. There's no room for improv there. Or, you know, although, guys need to change, because, you know, if the match doesn't work, then, then no matter how many times you try to make it work, if it doesn't work, it ain't going to work. You're going to change something. But... Who knows? Who cares? I don't know. Wrestling fans don't care about the inner workings of wrestling. So for all the independent wrestlers who want to preach about how oh, this thing works, you're wasting your time, brother. Anyways, going back to the point, because I'm deviating here. No, nobody ran me out. Nobody told me to quit except me. I drew a line. I said, if I cannot get what I want in 10 years, I'm walking away from it. Uh, my heart is still in it. But my body's not that in, in it anymore, so. Yeah, I'll find other ways that are somewhat I could be helpful to it. Wendy, of course, is very enthused about getting involved. Uh, but not as a wrestler, more of a manager later on, maybe. But in the meantime, you know, spread the word, help the independent groups to spread the word. If there are tryouts and such for new talent, we'll spread the word around, you know, which is... We'll just rather be behind the scenes on that one for the time being. Uh, our schedules are conflicting enough, so to speak, because we're constantly working on different things. If I'm not on a movie set, I'm on a show, a live show, a drag show with Wendy, and then, of course, you know, I got the uh, Ravencroft Mansion. I'm working in it right now, so to speak, for the uh, sinus sacred workshop so if I'm not working on movie set I'm working at the Ravencroft Mansion if I'm not working on that then I'm with Wendy at a drag show if I'm not doing that who knows I might do a commercial or something I mean I've been called everywhere I'm always busy I'm lucky if I get at 3 or 4 hours sleep every night you know that's pretty hectic I'm not complaining I'm just pointing out to the facts or pointing out the facts so uh, there you go there you have it for now I'll be posting more stuff. Stay tuned. Uh, Biggie surprise. February 2012. No exact date yet. 
Wendy is, has been posting stuff about it, and uh, we'll catch up with her and post stuff too on uh, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, you name it. I think it's about time Gina start talking more and and Wendy step a little bit on the side, although she's she's pretty entertaining. I like her a lot. She's my sister. Catch you later, guys. All right. And there is a road. Take a look. Take a look at the road over there. Yeah, look at that. They had an 18 wheeler. Yeah, look at that. Such a beautiful day. I know. Gina, you did great. Thank you. Thank you, babe. Okay. No problem, man. Turn it up. Oh. All right. Bye-bye.